Last summer on July 2nd, one wave at the beach changed Lacan Morales' life forever. That was just super fun, just, it's relaxing. Lacan Morales is a husband and father who loves to bodyboard. But last July, he caught a wave and wiped out. I was underwater and I was just staring at my, my, my arm, my hand, just like, like this, just staring at it. I couldn't move it. Lacan lost consciousness and was face down, not breathing for several minutes. Doctors say it's a miracle you're alive. Yeah, I mean, to be alive and not have brain damage. I'm lucky to even be here right now. A stranger in lifeguards rescued Lacan. Lacan, it's okay. Who woke up in the hospital to a new reality. It's hard, you know, being quadriplegic. <laughs> He can't feel anything from his chest down. His arms only move because he can rotate his shoulders. I can't move my hands or wrists. You can't pick things up with your hands. You can't write, you can't eat. No, not right now. Lacan's family has to lift him in and out of bed. And his friends are providing a lift too with a benefit concert at the Casbah this Sunday. That's awesome, I mean, uh grateful I have friends that are like helping out. Lacan works in robotics, but in his younger years, he was a DJ. El Dula is my homme de plume, as you could say, or my, uh, That's your my, DJ name? my DJ name. Lacan owns 5,000 records, and not being able to flip through his collection is one of his worst setbacks. Yeah, everything I love to do, I can't really do right now. No, it's going all the way anymore. During our visit, Lacan's two sons, Jordan and Nate, were looking after him. Like, he feels bad, I think mainly, not for himself, but more so for the rest of us and the things that we have to go through to be able to support him and provide care for him. His accident happened on the 4th of July weekend at a time meant to celebrate independence. Yeah, she hasn't stretched out today. Lacan lost his, but he's not given up. I have hope. I mean, you can't, you know, go through this without a little bit of hope. Lacan was told when they found him, he was surrounded by dolphins. You never know, flipper. <laughs> Sorry, got a flashback with the TV show. If dolphins can help rescue him, who knows, maybe he will walk again. Exactly. In the Zevely Zone, Jeff Zevely, CBS 8.